Welcome to Cute Fast Track Series for recommended practice number SNTTC1A. Personnel Qualification and Certification in Non-Destructive Testing. In this lecture, we will discuss Clause 5, Written Practice. In the following slides, we highlight important information contained in Clause 5 accompanied by the sub-clauses. Clause 5. Written Practice The employer shall establish a written practice for the control and administration of NDT personnel training, examination, and certification. The employer's written practice should describe the responsibility of each level of certification for determining the acceptability of materials or components in accordance with the applicable codes, standards, specifications, and procedures. The employer's written practice should describe the training, experience, and examination requirements for each level of certification by method and technique as applicable. The employer's written practice should identify the test techniques within each test method applicable to its scope of operations. The employer's written practice shall be reviewed and approved by the employer's NDT Level 3. The employer's written practice shall be maintained on file. Review questions Question number 1 NDT Personnel Qualification and Certification and Certification Written Practice in Accordance with SNTTC1A must describe the Answer is C. Question number two. The recommendation of SNTTC1A regarding the employer's written practice. Answer is A. Question number three. The recommendation of SNTTC1A regarding the employer's written practice. Answer is D. Question number four. What is the name of the document which should describe the responsibility for each level of certification and the training, experience and examination requirements? Answer is B. Question number five. The employer's written practice should.
Answer is D. Question number six. The employer's written practice shall be reviewed and approved by. Answer is C. This lecture is prepared by Samir Saad, and this is his profile.